All right, so here's guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, by the title, we are doing a makeup look for glasses. I'm not wearing any makeup right now, but I'm super excited. If you guys don't know why I wear glasses, I cannot see for the life of me. So I pretty much wear glasses kind of all the time. If I'm home, I usually wear glasses or I'll switch in out of like my contacts and stuff. But most of the time I wear glasses just so I don't strain my eyes a lot. So that is what we're going to be doing. I do a little bit of a different makeup for glasses just because like they're kind of like the focus of like my face. You know what I mean? So that is what I'm doing today. But I'm super excited to show you guys the glasses that I have on and that I have here. Um, I just want to thank Zenif for sending me these glasses. I love them. These are like the only glasses that I wear. These are like the same ones that I had before. So I'm going to show you guys these. If you guys want to get any of the glasses that I use, um, you can use my coupon code. It is Brooke. It'll be here on the screen as well as in the down bar as long as, ooh, as well as the information for all the glasses in there so I'm gonna show you guys the glasses here I'll leave all the information on the screen what they're called and all that and again in the down bar I always have the information in the down bar so yeah but we have three pairs of glasses here so let's show you guys the glasses and then we can do the makeup for what I do when I wear glasses so yeah that is what we're doing okay I'm gonna stop moving my hands a lot I'm just a lot also ignore my room I know it's a mess we're gonna pretend like it's clean, okay? Okay. <laughs> Alright, so the first pair of glasses we have here are these ones here. They're just kind of like square, roundish, clear glasses. I don't know why I've been into clear frames lately, but I love them. Um, these are just like my go-to. I have these in a gray pair that I had in my old prescription. So I got a new pair in my new prescription in just clear, and I love them. I just think they're super stylish. They go with like everything, and I just think they're cute. Like they're like, I don't know, they're like quirky. I like the clear vibe. I don't know. It's not like it's different not everyone uses clear so this is the first pair here um so let's show you guys the next pair so here is the next one here these ones are like a brown like goldish frame they have kind of like brown like i don't know it's like a wire mixed with brown um i think these are super cute they're definitely more like i don't know they give me like fancy vibes. I, I don't know. I love the clear ones though. I feel like they suit me super well. But these ones are very nice. They do have like the metal nose plate and all that. But these are super cute and I love them. They're really comfortable. Um, and I just, you need a good like brown glasses as well as like a clear. That's what I think. I think you need like the best of both. You know what I mean? So then you got, you got options. <laughs> All right. And the last pair we have here, these are my favorite. I'm obsessed with them. These are more of like a metal frame with a little bit of plastic, but I, these are my favorite. I love them. I feel like they look fancy, but casual at the same time. I just love the shape of them. They just, I love the way it looks on my face. Like the shape just looks so good they are like more of like a clear frame with like a silver trimming but i love these i just they make me feel fancy and they feel like super good quality i love it um but yeah those were the three glasses again if you guys want anything you can use my coupon code as long as you have your prescription you can enter everything on the website it's super easy but yeah if you guys want anything you can use my coupon code i will leave the links in the down bar but let's jump into the products the makeup of it all and we can do that glam it up a little bit and feel cute while we're wearing glasses because we want to feel confident but you don't need makeup we can go we can rock the natural look but you know what if you kind of want to look more alive this is the look for you so let's get into it okay all right I can't see I can't say I can't see for the life of me can I see now okay I still I can't see I'm gonna pop in my contacts just so I can see because I can't like look up close to my mirror you know what I mean all right so I popped in my contacts because I literally cannot see the life of me without being like this and you guys would not be able to see what I'm doing so I'll put them I'll take my contacts out after and then we can put on my glasses that's usually what I do anyways just because I don't like doing my makeup like this close it's just it's not it's not the vibe <laughs> okay so let's just jump into the makeup part all right so first I'm gonna start off with moisturizing and I'm using the Desi Cleo Kiss C vitamin C serum this is my favorite this is all I use this is my primer my moisturizer all that so that is what we were starting off with this let's get let's get this party started also it's like super late at night and I'm filming this so I'm using my light okay obviously I'm almost out of this 
I need to buy a new one. Actually, I think I have a spare. I do have a spare. Mm. Also, I didn't feel like doing my hair today, so this is what we're doing. This is what we're dealing with. <laughs> Alright, so I like to let my moisturizer sit on my face for a little bit before I, like, do my face makeup. So I'm just going to do my eyebrows really quickly. Um, I don't fill it in too much. I just have a little bit of sparse areas that I like to fill in. So, that is what we're going to do. Alright, Sorry, my eyebrows are done. Like I said, I didn't do a lot, um, but also I like my eyebrows to be like more like structured because that's what you see above your glasses, you know what I mean? So that is what we have on, but I'm going to do my face makeup next. Um, I have a little bit of like acne scarring, some dark circles, so we need to cover that up. Um, I use the Too Faced concealer in the shade Golden Beige and Light Beige. I'm like a mixture of two just because I'm like my lighter shade right now because of winter. So that's what we're putting on a face today. I'm not going to put too much on just because I don't like a heavy base. So I just do like a spot there, there on my chin and then on any I always put dots there and then on any marks that I have I do it there I always put one on the side because I get acne on the side of my forehead like so and one there and that's of golden beige and then I'm going to take light beige I honestly don't put a lot of this because it's kind of gray um so I just put like a little dot there that's it and then one here and a little bit there like I said not too much I don't want to be looking ashy and then I'm just gonna take my elf ultimate blending brush elf brushes are my go-to I have this is pretty much like all I use and I just use this to brush it on I like this because it doesn't make my face like cakey but it gives me coverage all right so I'm gonna go back in with golden beige oh that's not golden beige with golden beige and I'm just gonna pop this under my eyes just a little one there and on the other corner. And I'm going to take my e.l.f. blending sponge and just do my concealer under my eyes. Alright, so now that we got the even base on our face, I'm going to do some bronzer just because I feel like I look kind of pale. So I use a Rare Beauty concealer in the shade 460W and I use this to like cream contour in a way. I like the formula of it and I like how it blends, so that is what I'm using to bronze up my face. So I just do a small spot here. And then I use this e.l.f. blending brush to blend it away. It's like a dual brush here. And you can just see it blends so nicely. And I also make sure to like kind of drag it down my jaw. And then if I put a little bit too much, which it looks like I did, I just go back in with like the foundation brush that I used and kind of just Cut it out. And next I'm going to do cream blush. This is the Rare Beauty one in the shade Believe. This is like the new one. This is the dewy formula. I love this. I just put a little bit on the back of my hand and I'm using another e.l.f. blending like complexion brush. Again, it's a duo one. I just have two of them. Uh, so I just take it on the back of my hand and do this. It makes it easier to control it because I feel like this is super pigmented. So this helps me kind of like how much I actually want to put on my cheeks. I focus this on the high points of my face just because I want my face to look more because I already have a very round face. All right, so our face is like pretty much done. Um, I'm gonna go into my Laura Mercier um, translucent powder and just like set my under eyes and face. I do crease under my eyes, so I'm just gonna go back in with my sponge and kind of like smooth it out and then go straight into the powder with it. Alright, so now that I set my face, I feel like I lost a little bit of color, but I just go back in with like my blush brush, and I just, I have leftover on here, so I just go back in and apply a little bit just like this. Alright, so, our face makeup is done. Super easy, simple. It literally takes no time. I'm just going to take my makeup wipe and wipe my eyelashes, because I always get makeup on them. Alright, so I'm going to do a little bit of eyeshadow. Like I said, I feel like when you're wearing glasses, your eyes kind of get like taken away because you're wearing glasses. So I do a little bit of eyeshadow um, just because I like the way it looks and I actually like love doing eyeshadow. So I'm going to use this palette. This is the Carly Bible BH Cosmetics one. I don't know if they make this anymore, but this is what it looks like. It's just like a lot of neutral shimmery palettes. So if you have something similar to it, that is what you can use. Um, but I'm just taking a fluffy brush and going into this shade here. It's just like a matte brown shade um, for the crease. And I'm just going to pop that in here. 
And then I'm gonna, the same palette, I'm just using this entire palette. I'm gonna take this like square shade here. It's kind of like a goldy, like bronze color. And I'm gonna pop this on my entire lid. All right, so this is what we have on the lids. It's just like a little pretty like neutral shimmery shade. Uh, and then in the same palette, I'm gonna take this little, like it's like a dark bronze shade. I use my fingers for this. I'm just gonna pop this on like the outer corner just to add a little bit more dimension. And that's all I do. And then I'm going to go in with the same fluffy brush that I use for my crease. And just go back in there. So we're pretty much done for my eyeshadow. Like my eyes. It's really easy. I just do a little bit like more bronzy, darker shades. So then you can kind of like see my eyes. Um, so then I'm going to go in with my eyelash curler. I always curl my lashes no matter like what I'm doing. So I just curl them very intensely. Also, this helps so then your eyelashes don't touch your glasses frames because that happens when you're like wearing these. It touches because you're out. Anyways, that's what happens to me. So I like to curl my eyelashes, which is what I'm going to do. All right, so my lashes are curled now and I'm going to go into mascara. This is the Maybelline Sky High in Waterproof. It's in the shade like brown black, brownish black. I don't use black mascara. I just use this one. Um, I like how this makes my eyelashes look. It makes it like look like separated but natural at the same time but still looks like you have mascara on so I'm gonna use this one and just put like two coats on that's it all right so I have my mascara on I'm gonna let that dry but while we're doing that I'm just taking like a little pencil brush and I'm gonna go into the same matte brown shadow that we used in my crease and I'm just gonna pop this on the bottom lash line just to kind of add some shade there Alright, so this is what it looks like. I just feel like it smokes out the bottom and because you're wearing glasses, I feel like your eyes kind of get taken away from. So with this, it makes it pop a little bit more, which is what I want. And I have like very dark eyes, so like the brown shadow just makes my eyes like stand out a little bit more. Okay, and then I'm going to do a little inner corner highlight. Um, I take this little brush and I take setting spray. I don't know why I do this. I feel like it makes like the color stand out more. Um, this is just the Sephora makeup setting spray. And I just spray the brush one spritz. And I'm going to get into this palette. I'm telling you guys, this palette's like the best thing ever. I'm going to go into this shade here. It's just like a highlight shade. And we can pop this in. Yeah. And I'm just going to put this in my inner corner to brighten up the look a little bit. Just like so and I just feel like it makes my eyes look more awake and less tired so we have that and I'm just gonna pop some mascara on the bottom lashes not everyone likes mascara on the bottom lashes but I like it I feel like my eyes just look better with it so I'm just gonna put a thin coat on the bottom all right and this is what the eyes look like finished like I said it's very bronzy more like a smoky but like light smoky bronze um, but it still looks like bright and awake, which is what I love. So I'm going to pop out my uh, contacts now because I can actually, like I'm finished my eye makeup so I can see now. Um, so that is what I'm going to do. And then we can finish off the makeup look. So let me take these out. And which glasses should we, should we wear these ones? I'm feeling these. I like the vibe of this one today. Should I wear these or these? I'm feeling the clear ones definitely, but I don't know which one. That one looks cute too. Which one do I want? I think I'm gonna go with this one. I like how these ones look with my messy bun. I don't know why. So I'm gonna take my lip balm off that I had on. I just always have on lip balm. And I'm gonna wipe this off. It takes off my makeup on my lips. Um, I'm going to do like a lip gloss, lip, like a lip gloss lipstick kind of thing you know what i mean yeah no you don't okay so my go-to lip combo i've been using are these two here this is the rare beauty lip it's like a dewy lip balm lipstick kind of thing i'm in the shade thankful here um i love the formula of this i think it's so nice um but i'm gonna be putting this on first it's just like a nice tint like i said it's like a lipstick lip balm which i love so I'm just going to put that on. Um, and I'm going to go in with my Quo Lip Oil. Um, I don't think they sell this in the States, so I'm sorry. But this is like a Quo Lip Oil. I know it's kind of gross, but that's just because I mix it. And it's originally like a blue shade. So my pink has been turning it purple. Um, but yeah, it's just a lip oil. It's like 8 bucks. 
I just put this on top because I love a glossy lip. It's my favorite thing in the world. So I just pop this on like that. Oh, and we have one more step, which is eyebrows. Um, so I'm gonna go in with clear eyebrow gel. This is by Essence. This is my favorite eyebrow gel. This is what I use every single time I set my brows. Um, I'm just gonna put in just to make them look crisp and clean. My go-to. We're gonna fix the hair. And this is the finished makeup look for my glasses. I love doing this. Again, I feel like this just like makes my eyes pop. I feel like the eyeshadow really like stands out. It looks sparkly but like smoky at the same time, but still natural, which is what I'm going for. Um, but yeah, this is this look. I love it. I and these glasses, I'm obsessed with these glasses. I don't even want to wear my contacts because I literally love how the glasses look on me. I feel so fancy and I just I think I look so cute with them. So this is what the finished look is. Um, I kind of just, this is like kind of my everyday lazy look. I, this is my lazy look as I put on a full face of makeup. Um, but yeah, I just, this is my makeup. I really like it. Um, this is usually what I do with my glasses though. I like to wear a little bit heavier eye makeup when I'm doing glasses just so my eyes kind of stand out a little bit more. But yeah, this is going to finish the video. Um, I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Again, if you guys want any of this stuff, you can use my coupon code. It is Brooke here on the screen, as well as all my glasses in the down bar below. Um, all the links will be there as well. But yeah, I love y'all. Do not forget to love yourself. Um, thank you guys so much for all your support. I can't say thank you enough. But yeah, I love y'all. Don't forget to love yourself. Until next time, I'll see y'all later. Peace out, scouts. Bye.